Hello and welcome back everyone to the next episode on SAP Fury Security Come Fury Advanced Training. In our last episode, we talked about building our scenario for adapting the Launchpad content, which is applicable for those who are working on S4 HANA, latest but less than minus one release, which is starting 1909, 1809 and all the below releases, or you're working on SAP ECC. ECC for HANA or ECC or any other product where you're using Fiori, but not S4 2020. Starting S4 2020, we learned that SAP changing the strategy and they're introducing a new concept called uh, Launchpad Spaces and Pages. Yes, because there are challenges with the group. These are all the challenges we looked into it. So let's see how exactly SAP overcome these challenges with the help of spaces and pages. Now, before we start, let's quickly look at the introduction of spaces and pages in general, how in spaces and pages work actually, and how they help you to, to grow and implement S4 2020 content. So this is a new concept introduced starting S4 2021, sorry, 2020 in on-premise version. And what you see here is a structure of the new content. So in this structure point one to notice there is no group. Yes, the entire group concept has been deprecated and starting there we have a space. So on the page on the entire launchpad page, you would see these sections on the top which we earlier used to have as groups are now becoming space. So space completely uh, space out the concept of group. Then we have a page concept inside a space. We have got triple level modularization. So one group is now replaced by these three things. Yes. So then we have inside a space a concept of page. So we can have multiple pages inside a space. Then inside the page we have sections. And finally, at the end of section, we have the tiles. So earlier, these tiles were part of group, but now we've got these three new babies uh, to, to encapsulate your tiles and have a relationship with your role. If you eventually notice the remaining two things, which is page and section, they don't connect to role directly. Not at all, not at all. They don't, you don't need to add them in the role. What connects to the role is a space. So space encapsulate them and space is what goes inside the role. And then you add the tiles, of course, from the catalog to these sections and pages. So at the end, the role is granted to the user. So user will see all the uh, all those spaces and pages on the screen uh, as the first set of content. Uh, however, important thing, if you don't see a tile on the screen, doesn't mean you don't have permission. If the catalog has, let's say, about 50 tiles yeah all 50 tiles will you will get access to but you have to go to app finder but what user easily can see on the front screen when they start the launch pad is what is granted through this space and page just like the group concept which we learned in the last class so now let us go ahead and see how we build a space and how exactly the the content looks like behind the scenes. So first thing you need to notice, SAP introduced a lot of new stuff for you in 2020. And one of such stuff is a new role called SAP FLP admin role given by SAP. And once you grant this role, you get whole bunch of new tiles directly on the launch pad actually. Okay, so you don't have to go to the, uh, go to anywhere else to maintain the new stuff. You get directly these new tiles. So now we have the new tiles with S4 HANA 2020 with, with the role called SAP FLP admin. And notice here these two tiles. One is space designer, another is called page composer. These new tools are available under a section called Fury Launchpad. Other than that, you have manage launchpad apps, cross client, manage launchpad apps, business catalog, client specific. Yes. This is your mass maintenance tool, which has been enhanced. Uh, we will talk about this later. Then we have Fury Launchpad Designer in cross client and client specific, the FLPD Conf and FLPD Cust. Yes. And then you have the Launchpad Pages and Spaces. 
which is what our goal for today's chapter is i'm going to show you two big scenarios one scenario will be a custom scenario where we will build our custom um, custom page and space with our custom tiles uh, according to our last scenario for manager and employee in a company we will uh, take that and the second scenario where i will show you how you can directly also adapt sap delivered content now my next screenshot if you see there is a clear separation between customers created and sap created content in the past when you look at the groups there was just one section and eventually in that section you had everything dumped simply everything was dumped your z content y content and your sap groups standard groups were dumped into one single section but they have now a clear separation of what is owned by you and what is owned by sap so this is one benefit i see also as compared to groups in the in the new world in the new world of s4 hana 2020 perhaps this is going to be a very big and important topic if you are working latest s4 hana 2020 release and coming releases because it will eventually subside your group concept permanently yeah as of now i don't see any deadline that you should immediately replace your groups but you should definitely target towards learning this new stuff with anubo trainings we are providing the training to you to uh, master these concepts on space designer page composer and overall concepts including real time scenario and real time system so that you can actually adapt your content but one more important thing what people ask me very often anubo is there any uh, how easy it is to adapt and is it is it like automatic adoption no there's no automatic adoption there's no magic stick which i can give you where you just round that stick and everything is done there is no one click option you have to go and learn these concepts and then you adapt uh, your content according to the new concept and that's where uh, importance of a fury security uh, consultant uh, is very important in the real world today Join us on anuboutrainings.com for latest training on uh, SAP Fury Launchpad and Fury Security concepts where we will learn all these stuff. All right, so let's go to the system and experience this. So first thing what I'll do is I will grant myself uh, the, the role for this new role so that I can see and experience those uh, space designer and page composer Fury Launchpad and you see these new tiles don't be so confused we are only interested in these two middle one right now i'll open the space management i click on that and this is where we'll start creating a space you see already sap deliver a lot of spaces 178 spaces are already delivered by sap we will have a, another scenario tomorrow where i will show you how to use sap delivered content adapt it also this is my scenario one where i want to build everything from scratch so that i can understand the entire flow and or migrate the group which we created in the last session if you remember the last episode we created for nolan all the all the content for the groups and all for his content like he had two sales tiles three uh, tiles related to approval and also the timesheet and and leave request yeah so we had implemented the group but now this groups is obsolete concept so how do we now converge the nolan user how do we take nolan to the new content to the new concept this picture is super important if you really want to understand the space and page concept you need to definitely remember this photo there is one space it has multiple pages each page can have multiple section and each section can have multiple tile this you never forget just like the picture which we saw in the previous episode about technical catalog business catalog and also we talked about the content structure of the launch pad in the classical world you should never forget these pictures these are super important for you to be able to understand uh, end to end the topics okay so now let's let's move on so now you are, you are clear on the requirement that we have some custom launch pad design by far where there was a manager nolan and he was he was using the groups and all but now he want to migrate to the uh, the latest concept of space and page so you as a as a fury security consultant have to migrate this content in the same fashion to the new concept 
so we will add our pages now one page two page three page we need to add three pages let's do so i will filter this service over here i will check the service status the service is inactive let me activate the icf node with the local package and now it's green let me go back again as nolan refresh the service here voila magic happens the the service is loading complete end to end launchpad learning and troubleshooting with latest and greatest concepts come back to the fury launchpad for nolan refresh the page here and let's see voila everything works you got manager sales area yes sales and now you see two tiles you got hr space and look at that you get this nice tiny drop down for hr time management leave management i go leave management and voila look at this it doesn't load all the tiles at one go it will never cause a performance issue on your entire launch pad it will only load the small tiny tiny groups of tiles which will eventually gives you great performance improvement on launch pad switch to the new content for great performance improvement from the user point of view it doesn't load all the it doesn't flood all the groups wow what in end to end tutorial i'm done with today's class time for your questions what